Need some coins for the God Squad you've always wanted? Check out rockbottomcoins.com for the safest and cheapest coins anywhere. Make sure you check out the solo grinding service as well. Use code Zerk at checkout for a 10% discount on your order. The whole thing wobbing. What's going on guys? It's Xerxy coming at you today with another YouTube video and today I'm going to be doing a potluck pack for you guys and I'm also going to be going over some Blitz promo players that we know will be coming out. Now if you don't know already, there is some limited time solo challenges out right now that if you guys go ahead and play, they're only available for the next 24 hours for the Thanksgiving Day solos. They give you a free Blitz token for every single game. So make sure you guys get those done. But, before I open this potluck pack, I do want to show you guys exactly what will be coming out later tonight. And of course, I will be having videos on it later tonight as well. So make sure you guys hit that sub button and turn the notification bell on. So you guys can notify whenever I do upload those videos. But, this is really, really cool. So this is a little bit hard to see. But as you guys can see right here on the screen, we have 93 Tyreek Hill in the bottom right corner. It says, get ready for Blitz. Doors open at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. Special offers start at midnight. So, I'm going to imagine that the sets, we will be able to actually see at 8 p.m., but the packs won't be in store till midnight. But as you guys can see, in the bottom right corner here, we have 93 overall Tyreek Hill. Then, right to the left of them, we have a Game Changer pack. We have... Ezekiel Elliott, which you guys know I have been waiting so freaking long for a new Zeke. I am 100% getting Zeke on my team. It's not even a question at this point. Everybody knows it. I've been putting Zeke in my team of the week predictions for the past like two weeks. This man should have got a team of the week, but they decided to save him for the Blitz promo, and I am super freaking hyped. He better be like a 94 overall. I'd imagine he'll probably be 93, 94. And I will be very, very happy with that. Uh, we also have a gold premium pack next to him. And then we also, I believe that's Bud Dupree uh, on the bottom left corner. We also have a Legend Fantasy pack right above that. To the right of the Legend Fantasy pack, though, is Lamar Jackson. Then to the right of that is a Harvest pack. And it's really, really hard to see next to the Harvest pack. But that is actually Deion Sanders. So I do believe that the Blitz promo master is going to be Deion Sanders. So usually it's Night Train Lane because the fact that Night Train Lane got a uh, Mutt Monster, then it's going to be Deion Sanders. That's really, really cool. Uh, Deion's going to be super, super expensive. Oh my God. Seeing how I had to pay a million coins just to get his Legend card when I got it. Whew, I don't know if I'll be picking up this card, but we do have a clutch pack next to that. And then in the top right corner, you guys can see is Deshaun Watson. We can't see the player card art or even the overall, but there is an elite player pack next to Deshaun, uh, followed by Evan Ingram, who's going to be insanely fast. Probably the fastest end in the game. Uh, we also have a Mutt Hero Fantasy pack, and then to the left of him is Miles Garrett. Now, I don't believe that's, that's probably not all the players. Uh, that's only... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight players. So there might be a couple more player sets available as well. But holy crap, this is a really, really good batch of players. Seeing how Deshaun Watson already has a rising star, I'd imagine that card will probably be 91, 92. Uh, the lowest card seems to be Bud Dupree, who's only an 87. We can't see Evan Ingram's overall. Miles Garrett's a 93. Can't see Zeke's overall. Uh, Tyreek Hill is in 93 as well. Lamar Jackson looks like it says 80 something, maybe 90. Uh, I'm going to guess like 88, 89 overall. And then Deion Sanders, well, can't see his overall, but it's probably like 96. So this is going to be an insane blitz promo. And of course, guys, I will be having this video up for you guys as soon as possible. Once it does drop at 8 p.m., I'll have a video on the sets. And then at midnight, your boys need to be ripping some packs because I know you guys want to see some packs for tonight. So make sure you guys hit that sub button and turn the notification bell on so you guys get notified whenever I do upload that video. But with that being said, let's get into the potluck pack. I had some people ask me about where these limited time solos were on my earlier video, which if you haven't seen it, make sure you guys check it out about the primetime performers. But the Thanksgiving Day games are actually where you guys are going to be able to go ahead and get yourself some free Blitz tokens to use in the Blitz promo. You also get 3,000 coins uh, per game. So you get 18,000 coins total, and you also get 
six blitz tokens. So 110% you need to do this. Now, obviously the blitz token promo is gonna be pretty expensive to do if you're not gonna be spending money. Uh, you're probably gonna have to spend coins on packs to get the blitz tokens to get like Zeke, Tyree, Kill. I'm um, sure there'll be solo challenges as well and maybe like an exchange set uh, for your turkey flyers to go ahead and exchange them for some blitz tokens. But you definitely need to do these solo challenges, get some coins, get some blitz tokens. And then honestly, if you wanna participate in the blitz token promo if you want to get like zeke tyree kill all these good players you're gonna have to spend money that's just kind of how the blitz token promo is but with that being said let's get into the follow back by the way i forgot to say at the beginning of this video happy thanksgiving to you guys uh but we already made a potluck pack today i know you guys wanted to see this i literally used all of my turkey flyers that i was able to get from playing solo battles playing some solo challenges opening some packs to get this potluck pack and i gotta say uh, I actually think it's too late now to do turkey trotters. Um, is it too late? You have to do it at 10 a.m. The set's still available. What time? It's 11.30. Okay. <laughs> I guess they forgot to lock the sets or something. Maybe they're going to be glitched until the game starts, I guess. But uh, if you guys didn't do any of these, I believe Marvin Jones is questionable for the day. I'm not sure if he's actually playing on it. Let me know down below. Kenny Galladay, though, I'd say would probably be one of the better ones. Uh, he did actually have 100 receiving yards in the game that he, you know, Marvin Jones was out. <laughs> Eddie Jackson's one actually didn't have any tackles versus the Vikings last week. Byron Jones, now it's actually not going to be versus Alex Smith. It's going to be versus Cole, Cole McCoy, I believe. Um, still, interception, probably not going to happen. And then Vernon Davis, probably not going to happen. Mark Ingram and Devondre Campbell definitely could happen. But with this potluck pack, guys... This is probably the worst pack I've ever seen in my life. I've seen so many YouTubers open this. I haven't seen one good pull out of here. We get a silver, a power up, a legends player, a team of the week, a hall of fame, a rising stars, Gatorade, ultimate kickoff, night guardian, mump monster, sidekicker better, harvest, and team diamond. I don't see how this pack could be good. So let's go ahead and get into this pack. Um, I'm really worried about this. Let's just get right into it. Hopefully our team Donnie can be a little bit better. Obviously, we didn't really, you know, spend a lot of coins doing this. Also, really quickly, with the fact they're actually bringing out these Hall of Fame players in the potluck pack, I feel like there's going to be something going on with these Hall of Fame players very, very soon. I just don't know what, but I have a feeling we're going to be getting some sort of promo where we do need these Hall of Fame players. So we'll keep an eye on that as our Gatorade player is 79 Todd Gurley. We get a sidekick, 83 Haloti. No, that's not good. Uh, our silver player is just a silver. Our mutt monster is 82 Derrick Henry. Okay. It's really all about the uh, team dominant, to be honest. 80 Anthony Harris. We get a elite ultimate kickoff 83 Mark Barron. We get a 78 Christian Kirk. Our legend player is 82 Ted Hendricks. I believe the next one is the team diamond. Uh, actually, no, it's the harvest. Okay. 79 BJ Goodson. We also get a 77 Jeff Heuerman. Our elite is going to be 81 Sheldon Rankins. Our power up is 68 Deion Jones. It's actually not too bad. So, so far, this pack has been absolutely terrible. Final card, Team Diamond. Tom Brady. Wow. Okay. <laughs> All right. I literally know so many people are going to be mad about this. I can't tell you how many people talk to me on Twitter. And told me I was going to get something good out of this pod look back. Wow. Okay, so the pack was trash, except for Tom freaking Brady. I don't even know how much Brady goes for anymore, but he might be going for a little bit something special. Uh, let's take a look here at Tom Brady. That was um, pretty bad, aside from Brady. So let's take a look here. First off, Deion Jones. How much is he? Like 6K? 9,000 coins. Okay, it's actually not a bad power up. And then Tom Brady. How much is he? 250k that's not bad at all i will definitely uh take that from the potluck pack but i hope you guys did enjoy the video and if you did smack the like button subscribe and comment. i cannot believe we actually got an like a good team diamond pull uh for my potluck pack that is pretty crazy uh we also got mark baron it was like 10k we probably made about 300 000 coins off this so i mean it wasn't worth it to be honest, it still wasn't worth it unless you pull like Ramsey and then you got like a full legend or something, which I don't think anyone's gotten a full legend out of this. But 
92 overall team nine pull out of the potluck pack i cannot be too mad at that i hope you guys did enjoy the video and if you did smack the like button subscribe and comment you guys know i'm super excited about the blitz com promo coming out later especially now that we have tyreek hill and zeke coming out this promo is gonna be freaking ridiculous but i hope you guys enjoyed the video see you guys next time